tayo mo ngayon. Sibuk pa dahil mo ang pinay. Thank you. Okay. Just day night. Lota. Thank you. 
Wow, <laughs> you're very talented, sister. <laughs> so beautiful, like you. Oh, this is the Wednesday family. Do we have some entries from Victoria to Everyday Ranch? And they're not here. I don't think they're here. She's not here, right? She's in church. She's in church. And Jan Ray has moved away. And Myrna is the Tuesday family. How about this one? Oh, Arlene. 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 And Arlene. <laughs> this is just a very simple crochet, a simple piece. Um, I just started to do it this morning. <laughs> wow. <laughs> uh, this so, and then because this morning I keep on roaming around one time, and then I, I went to Google to, to know where is the place that I could buy the yarn and the crochet hook. So I spent so much time doing that, and then I I came here around 12 o'clock, and then I started to do this. She's sitting there. A very cute centerpiece. I can make it very big, though, a lot of time. But then at home, I sent all of these things that I've made. So I sent the cookies. I make a lot of centerpieces at home. So... The thing is, I the one the thing that I've learned about this is, you know, it's it's quite difficult for me to you know, do this kind of thing. I use the hook and it is quite, you know, painful because it's been so long that I didn't make this one. So I am so grateful that I have this kind of talent that you know I've learned this one since my primary years. During my primary years. Oh, so yeah, primary. Yeah, primary. I was primary. And now I'm already 50 something. <laughs> 50 years? 50 something. Parang hindi niya kami sa adong edad niya kasi something. Thank you. So that's a testimony to what we can learn in primary. I, I learned to crochet in primary also, and yeah. I do not remember. <laughs> I could not do it today, especially two hours. Oh, wow. Okay, who? Uh, oh, El, uh, Brother Anderson. Oh, it's part of the Come and talk about your art. And I don't think is Sister Sister Anna Lynn, who did these, is is upstairs in church also. So. Okay. So this is. 20 years ago, wow. I was in Ghana, West Africa, with my wife. We just got married. And she was doing anthropology study, and I had already graduated. So I didn't have anything to do, but <laughs> this was a beach we on. And we were in Ghana for three months. So. And this was another one, Jesus. Ganda. So I had maybe seven or eight paint, uh, watercolor, uh, acrylic paints. So I didn't have many colors, so I had to improvise a little bit. And then this, we went to a village um, about 20 minutes from where we lived. And I just took my easel and stood it up for like three hours and painted it. Okay. I thought it was pretty cool how Ghanaian <laughs> women can balance the yeah. walls on top of their head and carry things. And they have little baby wrapped on their back. Mm -hmm. It's very different. <laughs> experience. This one is in Humpty, if you're in Hong Kong. 
Yeah. Oh. So there's a little causeway, and then the ocean is behind there. And I did this one this week, just really quick, with colored pencil. Savior, all the cheese and cheese. Drop their nets and be disciples. Did you do that from memory, or did you look no, at No, I looked at a picture for that one. to me and the things you create and the love that you have in your hearts and the talents that you have are just amazing so thank you for sharing them today I think this has been a lovely time that we've had to um, because all of our gifts come from Jesus Christ don't they all of our gifts and talents come from him he's the source of all of it and the inspiration that we get to create something um, I remember when um, Elder Uchtdorf gave a talk about the creation and talked about how we're all creators and that Heavenly Father invites us to create and what you've done and what is even in your heart and what you even wish to do like Sister Maribel for so many years to learn something new, all of that is part of creating. So um, thank you for sharing and I encourage you to keep creating because it inspires others and it honors the Savior, Jesus Christ, and our Heavenly Father. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen. amen.